Hello Libra! This month your ruling planet will turn retrograde and you've got a little bit of relationship rehab ahead. Here's why. On March 4th, Venus will turn retrograde right in your partnership sector. She remains hibernating until April 15th and over the next several weeks you and your partner will be re-evaluating how your relationship is going. Even if you're happy together, there are a few kinks to work out. Maybe it has to do with some unresolved issues from the past. It might even have to do with a financial matter or your mutual feelings of being appreciated in the relationship. So don't be afraid to work through this now. If you're ending a relationship and you're going through a divorce or some kind of settlement issue, this Venus retrograde cycle will be a lot of back and forth to resolve that. And I expect it to be resolved by the end of April. On the 12th, there will be a full moon that occurs in your hidden 12th house. And this could be an emotional time for you where you're really feeling like you are spent. You just need to take some time to yourself. If you can, go on a little retreat away from the whole world for a couple of days. It will really serve you well. And if you can't, just try to carve out a few hours a day to be by yourself, to center yourself, take a yoga class, meditate. Even if you just light a candle and stare at it for 20 minutes, that'll do wonders to just help calm you. I sense that you're pretty anxious mid-month and you want to kind of deal with that as best as you can. Then on March 27th, a new moon will fall in your partnership sector. Now Venus will still be retrograde there, but with this new moon over the next couple of weeks, you and your partner have an opportunity to begin a new phase of your relationship. And ultimately it will serve the both of you. You're, you're going to do what's best for you as a couple, but you're also recognizing that you're two individuals within the couple. And you're going to figure out how to maximize your personal growth and relationship growth with this new moon. Now that you know what's in store for you this month, be sure to watch more astrology videos with me right here at tarot.com.